Aaron Latin and his girlfriend Alba were curious to see what the hurricane could have brought to the beach. I wanted to get like a metal detector, and especially after the hurricane, come out here and see if there's anything, any history or artifacts that kind of washed up on the shore. But they were left puzzled by what they found. First, I, we just thought it was a rock. The more we got to look and we realized it was something uh, more than a rock. <laughs> Authorities say they found two Civil War era cannonballs unearthed by the hurricane and laying in the sand. We actually just got got lucky with no equipment, just spending a day at the beach. Now the location is right in front of the Morris Island Lighthouse on the very edge of Folly Beach. It's kind of hidden in this brush, but this isn't the first time the cannonballs have been found in this area. 16 Civil War cannonballs were found in the same location following Hurricane Matthew in 2016. Great day for Folly Beach. But other treasure hunters weren't so lucky. After the big hurricane, I thought I'd find some nice stuff. And like I said, I've been doing it for over 20 years. I found some junk, maybe some mini balls, a few uh, pieces of metal. Nice young couple, five minutes before us, walks across a cannonball. <laughs> they reported it, and afterwards, police, fire, and local EOD teams responded, making sure the cannonballs weren't still live and dangerous. The couple said they are new to the area and are happy that they stumbled on a piece of history. Es un tesoro histórico. It's a historical treasure. It's the history of here in Charleston. Of course, after we found it, we wanted to tell the world. On Folly Beach, Lillian Donahue, Live 5 News.